through soft sand much easier. This style of guard doesn't allow stones to even rise past the height of the tow bar. The left side of the 440 is the kitchen side, which simply slides out and doesn't require extra support legs so nothing touches the ground. The basins are removable to give them extra versatility, making it easy to gather water from a nearby stream. With two basins, one can be used with a small amount of hot soapy water and the other for rinsing, which helps to cut down on water usage. The two drawers house all the cutlery and crockery, specially fitted to handle rough tracks. Everything is designed to fit inside the basins, and the drawers are also partially hollow, so they act as a draining area after washing up. The 440 holds 160 litres of water, and the Webasto diesel system is used to heat the water. The stovetop is easily accessible, and the fridge freezer is either 74 or 90 litres. The left side also features a huge pantry, which can be accessed from both inside and outside the trailer. The pantry has a small fold-down table to prepare food, and the door has two fold-down tables. And of course, where would a UEV be without a minibar? Having three deep layers in the pantry, the 440 offers more than ample storage here. For extra storage though, the right-hand side also has four easily accessible boxes, and the inside of the door has handy canvas storage pockets for lighter items. The rear wheel carrier on the 440 is home to the emergency hub assembly and the barbecue plate, which sits over the spare tyre and can be removed and placed over the fire. The wheel carrier opens to the right and the rear doors almost open themselves, with the gas struts doing the lifting for you. The rear lifts up and the lower section drops down and has a step built in. You can now choose to drop the patented stabiliser legs at the rear of the trailer, these are extremely quick to fold out and just as quick to pack up. Like the doors, the light alloy roof also lifts itself up. The right hand side of the trailer folds out to make the side bed. It's designed so that nothing touches the ground. Spring steel is used instead of guide ropes and the canvas simply clips into place to stay taut. The front bed opens in a very similar fashion to the side. The canvas used throughout the 440 is military ripstop, mildew resistant, UV stabilised and has been fully submerged in waterproofing solution. However, you can also fold out a fly over the canvas. This aids cooling, means windows can be left open in the rain and the fly can be the last to fold away, so even when packing up in the rain, the canvas is kept dry. With the beds out, you are greeted with a huge living area. Conquer Australia offer all number of options, like flat screen digital HD TVs, surround sound splash proof stereo systems, LED lights throughout, interior heater, interior fans, and although every window can be opened fully, midgy mesh can be zipped up to cover every opening on the trailer to ensure bugs stay out. This is a full size suitcase, and one of these fits in every single compartment you have here. More the 440 also has a huge L shape awning. To set this up, lower the roof, Unzip the bag and let the canvas fall on the side and rear. Join the two awnings together with the zip, then let the roof lift the canvas up for you. Then simply erect the awning. The awning poles are kept in a special compartment on the side of the trailer, which also just happens to be a great spot to store your fishing rods. The awning is also a good spot to rest one of Conquer Australia's almost paper thin military spec solar panels. For more specific details on the UEV 440 or anything not covered in this video, contact Conquer Australia directly.